What is up guys, Trek54HD here and welcome to another episode of My Road to Glory. Um, basically guys, I'd love to say thank you so much for the response on Global FIFA Gaming. On my last Road to Messi series, um, it's actually now on 241 likes. Now, that's around 100 more likes than I've ever got on a video. Um, you know, the response was amazing. Um, I honestly never thought I'd ever get that many likes on a video and you know the response recently has been absolutely amazing on the videos and honestly all of your support is amazing um, all the video all the money generated from them videos as well is going to charity so you know it's for a good cause um, you guys are amazing for you know everything that you've done for me um, but anyway back onto the video now guys and as you see here we're pretty much cruising this game um, a lovely finish there from Gotse to make it 3-1 in the 83rd minute um, you know, he's a, becoming to be an outstanding player for me. When I first did get him, he wasn't, uh, you know, the player that I thought he'd be. But, you know, now he's settled in, um, he's definitely a player that I'm going to be keeping right until the very end. And uh, he's definitely booked his place there throughout the series. So, um, let's see there, Gotse just absolutely power horsing through the midfield and defence um, and scores a lovely goal to end it off on that game with uh, us winning 4-1 getting around just under a thousand coins from that match which um, is pretty nice to go into the market with I'm not going to lie you know there's a lot to you know now the market has crashed because of the uh, inform Ronaldo in the pack um, you know you can definitely pick up some a, a lot more higher quality players for you know a lot more cheaper than you would have been able to say a couple of weeks ago but um with all the coins that we got from that match we actually had to you know go into the market and buy some contracts for our players um three players were out of contract and you know I, I may as well actually you know apply them now because you know it's a uh, I'm gaining quite a lot of coins from matches, so um, I'm, I'm not going to be bothering to, you know, just discard the player and buy it again. Um, a lot of you did say actually in the comment section that I can buy gold contracts for 200 coins. Um, on PS3, it's a bit, a little bit different. You know, you have to sort of wait for them to come up in the 59th minute before you can buy them. You have to be pretty quick, and honestly, can't be asked. Um, for the sake of a couple more games in the contract, I really can't be bothered. But um, as you see in the, here in this game, we are, you know, pretty much cruising again 2-0. Um, you know, and we're playing in snowy conditions. That is the worst conditions ever for me. Um, I absolutely hate it. But you know, we uh, it's c becomes three one. He did score a trampy goal then um, a second ago. But you know, Rafael Subi comes again with the odds and makes it three one. And that's how I finished, guys. Um, I was so happy to get that game over and done with. Really do hate that condition um, with the snow and stuff like that. Gain around eight hundred thirty two coins from that match to go into the market and buy. Um, a new CDM for the Bundesliga side of the hybrid squad. Um, you know, we were going to pick up this Luis Gustavo. Um, well, at least I think that's his name, the Brazilian player for Bayern Munich. But we've seen turn our attention to Mikael Balak. And, um, you know, he's a great all round player. And all of the FIFA Ultimate teams, he's been one of them players which has sort of kept his rating and kept around that 80 to, you know, 84 mark. And um, it definitely is a player that can definitely have an impact on the game and is in very, you know, is he's a very strong player in midfield and um, to have him on my team now is uh, you know really good because you know we definitely needed someone that could hold in the midfield and you know um, have a nice amount of defensive stats rather than more attacking stats as for the 86 heading and 79 defending you know that's absolutely brilliant 82 shooting as well he's got some great free kicks uh, to say the least we also buy a centimeter CDM card to apply to him for 400 coins um, you know that's a pretty good deal in my eyes. I'm not gonna uh, spend any more than that, and or probably wouldn't even be able to get them for less. So, um, Lucas was out of contract as well, and you know we had to remove him from the squad and just add in. Um, I think we added Yukonen into striker and put Rafa Sobis in centre attack and mid in that match, um, and obviously put Mari on the bench to in replace of Lucas. So, come against this guy called Badgerfield FC. Um, he has a Valdez in goal and. Pretty much the rest of the team was pretty much awful. Um, but this is why I bought Gortse, guys. Look at that dribbling. Um, absolutely precision and, you know, absolutely amazing play by him. In the sixth minute to wake it 1-0. And Breno here gets pretty lucky from a rebound. And then, you know, I, honestly, I don't know what his defender was doing on the line. Um, you know, that was an absolutely easy finish to make and uh, an easy way to clear it as well. And he just couldn't pull it off. Um, so, you know, a lot of luck in this game went my way. I'm not going to lie. Um, you know, you can in there have a finish as well to make it 3-1 in the fourth minute. And then this, this guy just uh, decides to rage quit. Um, you know, I'm not going to not gonna lie. I, I don't feel um, bad about uh, him rage quitting. You know, he, 
in a in a way I don't even really care because you know all the luck was going my way in that match and um, I'd probably have done it the same as him. So um, getting around 600 coins from that match for playing you know 40 minutes, which um, is pretty decent. Uh, we actually have to spend all our coins on these contracts for these players. So this is coming to the end of the episode, guys. I really do hope you enjoyed it. Um, you know the response again on the last video is really good, nice um, to see and you guys do really enjoy this series so I'm going to be bringing one of these one a day guys as usual like I've been saying and um, also there will be a couple of videos on Yao soon I'm just sorting the series together so I'll be posting a link here um, when I do upload onto there but anyways this is going to be the end of the episode please leave a like if you did enjoy it and also guys follow me on Twitter um, you know I can retweet your videos and stuff like that and give you um, you know speak to you on there as well it's a bit more a better place for you guys to speak to me rather than PMing me, PMing me on YouTube or something like that so thanks for watching guys please leave a like if you enjoyed and as always have a nice day